China is one of the world's most populous countries with a unique blend of ancient and modern civilization. Westerners have long held a fascination with this distant land, in part because it seems to hold so many secrets. From the construction of the 13,000-mile-long Great Wall of China, erected thousands of years ago, to the so-called digital Great Firewall, restricting the Internet today, China has taken extraordinary measures that have prevented both people and information from entering or leaving its domain. But why? According to ancient astronaut theorists, the answer may be found by looking back 5,000 years to China's beginnings and the reign of their very first ruler, the Yellow Emperor. The Yellow Emperor is understood to be a human figure, but originally in his earlier incarnation, he was actually a divine celestial figure. He was a god associated with thunder and lightning more specifically and he was thought to reside in the sky. The reign of the Yellow Emperor, which purportedly lasted 100 years, was thought to be a high point of Chinese culture and of civilization. So he's associated with a number of technological developments spanning from the calendar, advances in mathematics, astronomy, agricultural techniques, writing as well. According to ancient accounts, the Yellow Emperor possessed knowledge of advanced technology and invented many mechanical devices, including a cauldron that was oriented towards the Xuan Yuan star, the star from which he is said to have descended. It was written that the cauldron could make a dragon appear from the sky. When the time was right, he crafted the cauldron, and in it, he threw in some alchemical ingredients, uh, elixir ingredients. And immediately, the heavens opened, and a dragon emerged. So, a flying dragon, sometimes described with metallic skin. One has to wonder, do we have descriptions of nuts and bolts machines? Could these be nothing else but descriptions of misunderstood technology. Based on our research, the Yellow Emperor arrived in the wonderful land of China through an aircraft. We Chinese people consider ourselves the descendants of the dragon. In UFO research, a dragon is the symbol of aircraft, that is, the symbol of a UFO. Is it possible the Yellow Emperor was an extraterrestrial that was responsible for starting Chinese civilization over 5,000 years ago? And if so, might subsequent emperors, who all claim to be descendants of Wang Di, have been at least part alien as well?